the critical thinker then asks additional questions. They don't take it at face value. <laughs> now, critical thinking is, I was talking yesterday on a podcast with a guy, and we both, he was very wealthy and very successful. And the two things that we both agreed on was critical thinking. So critical thinking is, as we've talked about here many times, is when uh, somebody tells you that 500 acres a day of the Amazon is burning down. Don't quote me on any of this. I'm using this as an example. And you're like, 500 acres a day is burning down. That sounds terrible. And you stop there. That's Mm non-critical thinking, right? You're just like, and then you go do your whole world. Everything you think about is 500 acres a day and how terrible that is and who's responsible and we're going to crush it all. The critical thinker then asks additional questions. They don't take it at face value. Typically, typically we're going to take the thing that we want to hear at face value because it's, it's, it's exactly what we want to hear and we don't want to risk hearing more that might upset that thing that we agree with, that we're comfortable with, that we know, that doesn't challenge us necessarily. This is what I think. And so we don't ask the additional question, which is, what is, how many acres are there? Yep. Didn't that be a normal question? How many total acres? How many total acres are there? Then you find out that there's 827 billion acres. And how fast are they reproducing? And it's reproducing faster than we're burning it down. Once again, don't quote me. I'm not saying this is reality. I'm using this as an example. Uh, And it's really not as big a deal as we make it out to be. Um, And then there are the forest fires and the smoke and it F's up the ozone. Yeah, that's terrible. The smoke. I know, you know, we just dealt with smoke here in Oregon uh, for about a week, which was brutal. It was everywhere. Uh, But again, the next question is how many forest fires start naturally, right? How many fires in the Amazon begin from lightning strikes and Mm -hmm. the indigenous people uh, lighting the shit on fire and all the rest of that? What, you know, where are we there with those numbers? And then you find out, oh, well, they're a thousand times worse than. The man-made fires, that's actually less than the other fires because they're controlled burns and you know, whatever. Yeah. But that critical thinking, see, if you're one that's, that, that likes the idea of, of protecting the environment, you're going to hear a stat like that and you're going to stop right there and not ask that additional question. <laughs> 